turn YouTubers into axolotls. And we have three objectives. Find a mine shaft and save the Preston axolotl. Breed two of the YouTuber axolotls in the nether. And finally, defeat the ender dragon and the wither at the same time. But all of this has to be done in hardcore mode. Can I do it? You'll have to stick around until the end to find out. So the sheep is the first mob that drops one of our YouTuber axolotl friends. Thank you. Look at this. Tell me in the comments that you know what YouTuber this is. It's the dream axolotl. Does nothing at all, but might be useful later. Can you at least put it down? <gasps> you can! Look at this, dude. He's so cute. I bet you we use the dream axolotl to breed with another YouTuber to get another axolotl. But the next YouTuber axolotl we actually get from cows. And there it is. <laughs> yes, it is the George axolotl. Ooh, and it's got two abilities. Press V to swing and B to water your plants. He's on our back. <laughs> what? It's a grappling hook. Remember, we're in hardcore mode and we could have literally just died. So it's got another ability too. You just press B to water your plants. You can spawn water. And if you haven't already, please like the video. I hope you enjoyed because we're about to have way too much fun today. Remember, the first objective is to save the Preston axolotl from a mine shaft, which hopefully is directly beneath us. Oh, hello there, zombie. How are you doing today? Take some of this. I thought it only spawned water. It actually deals damage. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait a second. We're getting damage dealt to us. I had no idea that the projectile did damage. This is insane. Oh, thank God. We're not going to die today. We might not be quite ready to go save the Preston axolotl. There are more YouTuber axolotls on the surface. In specific, one of the YouTuber axolotls is actually in the ocean and it's dropped from squids. It's the wisp axolotl. I see him. I see squids. You can't escape us. Just give us the yes. <laughs> there it is. Oh, we've got it. The wisp axolotl. Empowered mining. Hold them in your offhand to empower your pickaxes. What is multi-mining. Oh, 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 yes! Okay, this is next level. We just found a spider. Spiders drop the Mr. Beast axolotl. I feel like Squirtle from Pokemon. Just hit him with that water spray. Yes! Can we just appreciate how beautiful this axolotl is? Zombie, you're ruining the moment. We're trying to really appreciate how beautiful the Jimmy axolotl is, and you're kind of ruining it. I love how you can use both the water gun and the axe at the same time. It's ridiculously powerful. We're gonna just quickly make an iron pickaxe because I wanna see how powerful the wisp axolotl is when we actually have a good pickaxe. Oh, this is, oh, it's breaking in a four by four radius. Oh, I'm telling you right now, we are just, okay, this is, oh. Wait, I didn't take fall damage. Why didn't I take fall damage? I think an axolotl is keeping me from taking fall damage. There's more to this axolotl though. I know there's more to this. All right, so if you put the wisp axolotl on the ground and don't suffocate him to death, you get rainbow ore. <laughs> oh, dude. All right, I knew the rainbow ore was powerful, but I did not know it was this powerful. What is this on the left? We literally have the best effects in Minecraft. Oh my goodness gracious, dude. Look at this. We already have a diamond pickaxe. The pickaxe is breaking in a five by five now. We found the mine shaft. Our first objective was to go to a mine shaft and rescue the Preston axolotl, which is in one of the chests. But before we do that, I'm wondering, can we technically break bedrock? You can literally break bedrock, can't you? Oh, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, 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 that was so close. Come on, all right, there's gotta be a chest nearby. This is, the, oh, there it is. Yes, the Preston axolotl, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know what, oh, he's going crazy. <laughs> whoa, whoa, let's just calm down. Hey, let's just relax. Now I see why it says don't let him out. Of course, I can spawn lava sources. You see that zombie? Burned. Oh my, this is sick. We just accomplished our first objective and we haven't even shown off the Mr. Beast axolotl. All it says is infinite resources. I don't know what that means, but we're gonna find out. But before we find out, can you do me a quick favor? Hit that subscribe button, please. We're almost at 11 million subscribers and we're gonna meet a ton. All right, so let's see what this does. Look, we're gonna put them on the ground. Oh, we put the wisp one down too. What's the, oh, wait a second. Do you see what I'm seeing? He jumps on to hostile mobs and makes them drop their items. So the zombies are like spam dropping rotten flesh. He's like a vampire axolotl. I've never seen something like this before. I'm actually a little bit terrified. So t can I get him off of the zombie? He's literally staying on the zombie until he's dead. So like, look at him, he's like latched onto the skeleton. So he's making the skeleton drop bones, which is actually pretty helpful. 21 bones. But we're not done yet. I gotta see what he does. I I'm assuming he's gonna make the creeper drop gunpowder. Oh, he makes him drop TNT blocks. This is sick. 
Oh my gosh, the Mr. Beast axolotl might be my favorite so far. Like, let me know down below in the comments who's your favorite axolotl. Now, also, he has a different ability. So if you have something in your offhand, so for example, steak, and you right-click with him, it duplicates it. So now we have four steak. Do it again, <laughs> you get eight steak. You can basically repeat this process to duplicate as many items as you possibly want. I think the dream axolotl is used to breed in the nether. So once we get into the nether, we can breed the axolotls together to complete our second objective. And there's other YouTuber axolotls, which you can only get from certain nether mobs, which we're about to find out. All right, I just listen, before we go to the nether and breed two of the YouTuber axolotls, I, I gotta see this, man. This is like a once in a lifetime opportunity. It just drops cooked beef and leather. It's amazing. Oh, but this is the mob I've been wanting to try it out on. Go. Tell me. Yes! It drops into pearls. We have 11 into pearls, ladies and gentlemen. Look at this. He's like just sucking the ender pearls out of him. I mean, this is pretty much all we need to beat the game now. I'm gonna see if we can turn all of this into lava. This is just a strange way to make a portal. I know. I'm, I'm telling you, this is a lot harder than it looks. Okay, it's working. Yes, the portal is complete. Yes, here we go, dude, into the nether. So in order to get to bionic axolotl, we have to take out zombie pigmen. Unfortunately, these are just piglins. I know I need to breed these, but I gotta see what does the zombie... Oh, come on, go get the zombie pigmen. Get him, that's right. What does he drop? Oh, he just drops rotten flesh. That's so lame. Get back in the bucket. <gasps> Wait, it's okay. Hold on, we got the bionic axolotl. It was like a blessing in disguise. Oh man, all right. So we're supposed to be breeding an axolotl, but then we got the extra axolotl, aka the bionic axolotl. Let me kill this guy real quick. Thank you. Oh, wait, you can fly? Oh, you can, oh, you can fly. <laughs> so the Bionic Axolotl is a jetpack, but you do have a fuel bar. You gotta like freeze if you want the fuel to recharge. This is incredible. If you have the Bionic Axolotl on and you swap it to the George one, you have infinite fuel. I don't think this is supposed to happen, but it's amazing. I got duct tape, okay? I must have gotten this like in the overworld before we went to the nether, but it says put one and one together to get the ultimate life form. I'm assuming we're gonna need this to breed. The two axolotls who are best to be bred together is Dream and Preston. I mean, cause why not? Now using the duct tape, the Preem axolotl bucket. Can we please get this trending on Twitter and in the comments, hashtag Preem. This might be my favorite ship name of all time. It literally says the dragon slayer, the power of lightning and fire is on its hands or paws. We just completed objective number two for the video, but we can't place this down in the nether it only works in the end. I have an idea. I see we just fly to another fortress because blazes are gonna drop the next YouTuber axolotl, which of course is the handsome Skeppy axolotl, one of the cutest men in the Minecraft community. I do, however, I need I need to like abuse the wisp one a little bit more. You know what I mean? I gotta I gotta I gotta put him down. I gotta pick. Do not suffocate. You know what? Go ahead. Live your live your life, buddy. And then we're gonna yeah we're gonna take some of these effects. Boom, we're back in. I'm oh, wait a second. <laughs> Hold on. Oh my. <laughs> Let's go. We found the fortress. Oh, wait. Hold on. We actually need to get wither heads from the wither skeletons. So I'm going to need to put down the Mr. Beast. Oh, I put down the wisp. Get back in. Don't you die. Oh, wisp. Don't scare me like that again. Look at the... Oh, my God. Why there's so many wither heads? This is insanity. Three stacks of wither skulls. This is too many. Can he get to the blazes? He can. He just attached. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> Jimmy is on the blazes, and they are dropping the blaze rods. It's perfect. Now, the question is, will he also drop a Skeppy axolotl bucket? Uh, he will. <laughs> and there he is. Look at this. Look at how many blaze rods we have. Hold on, let's just go and make our eyes of ender. That's the Skeppy axolotl. A bit of trolling doesn't do any harm. Right click to use a world edit. You know we're gonna do a wither? Like, I feel like we can do 15 withers plus the ender dragon and we're still gonna win. I'm literally that confident. All we have to do is get some soul sand. Alright, so what does this do? What does it do? Oh, uh, so we're literally world editing the nether as we speak. <laughs> just by right clicking the bucket, like, it just is deleting stuff. I, <laughs> this feels so illegal. <laughs> What did we do? <laughs> I've unintentionally enchanted everything. I didn't realize it, but when I was right-clicking, I must have been placing down the Skeppy Axolotl, and then he was probably just enchanting everything. So you just, like, everything is getting enchanted. My pickaxe deals 66 attack damage. Okay, how about this? Let's just find that soul sand so we can make the withers in the end, and let's skedaddle out of the nether. I'm, I'm done with you, nether. This, this feels so weird. All right, and then we just duplicate the soul sand with the Mr. Beast bucket, and just in case, we can make a lot of withers. Now. Oh, there it is. There it is. I didn't want to break it. I was like legit worried we were going to break this. All right, let's go ahead and just pop all these bad boys in here. All right, we got to make one more. 
Put him in there, and there we go. Oh, man, dude, I'm so hyped for this. All right, this is it. So remember, now that we're here, okay, the last objective was to defeat an Ender Dragon and Wither simultaneously, but we also have the Preem Axolotl, all right? The combination of Preston and Dream is supposed to be so strong, it's devastating, all right? So I don't know how it's gonna work, but we're gonna test it out. I'm gonna make a few of these. I'm really confident here that we're gonna be fine. Genuinely not that worried. If anything, I think this is gonna be kind of a cakewalk. The dragon might die by attacking me. I don't know how many more withers we can make without like totally breaking the game. I'm gonna just do this for now. I think, I think we've got enough. All right, there's a lot of withers and there's a lot of wither effect and it's kind of actually dealing some damage. So I'm just gonna fly up. Can we just pickaxe these guys? Can we just like, I just whack them? Oh yeah, look at that. <laughs> we already killed the wither. Gave him a couple of whacks and he's gone. I don't even see, I don't even think I'm taking damage. Like I've got wither two for 30 seconds and I don't, I don't think I'm dying. All right, I gotta take out these other withers. This is ridiculous. Look at these withers. They're not even like, they're just, <laughs> you can just spam them all to death. Look at this. Boom, 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 boom. There you go. Boom. There you go. Okay, that's another one. That's another one. That's another wither dead. Look at that. There we go. That's another one. <laughs> all right, there's two more withers left. Come on. Oh, man. All right. We have Wither 2 again for another 30 seconds. So I think this is where we put down the pre-maxolotl, all right? We haven't even gotten to use this guy yet. Put him down. Oh, he's beautiful. <laughs> he's following us. Wait, what does he do? Oh, he's dealing damage to the Ender Dragon with lightning. Wait a second. Hold on. I've got an idea. We're about to go 1,000 IQ over here. All right. I don't know if this is going to break the game, but we can technically duplicate the pre-maxolotl bucket, right? Like, look at this. Boom. Put him down. Put him in the offhand. We duplicate him again. We're just gonna, just gonna keep you. Oh my god! We are duplicating so many of these. This is actually disgusting. All right, so now we just pick these up and we put them down. Oh my goodness! I don't even know what's happening anymore. Lightning is striking even us. But we can't stop here, ladies and gentlemen. We must continue the duplication. More duplications! I literally can't hear anything because the army of Preems are just striking the Ender Dragon with lightning. Like, look at this. Like, he's just gonna die to lightning. So, the game's not over yet. We killed the Ender Dragon, but we haven't killed the Wither. In fact, I don't even know where the Wither is. There he is. Come here, buddy. Come here. So your time is up, bud. It's over. And there we go, ladies and gentlemen. Every objective was completed in this video. Make sure you subscribe. God bless. Click either one of these videos, and I will see you all next time.